That's not what I heard. Say. These are bad times. Hey, you! Where you going? No matter what your plans are, there'll be plenty of time later. You're right in front of the Pearl of Corinnis, the Red Lantern. This is the most beautiful brothel in all of Mirtana, damn it. Sailors from the most remote corners of the world dock here just to spend a few nights in the Red Lantern. And now it's you who has the chance, nay, the honor of spending a night with Nadia, the most passionate flower of the gods. Come on in, and you're going to experience what others cannot even dream of. What are you standing around for out here? Go on in and meet our passionate Nadja. This hot creature of the night will give your life a new meaning. I don't believe that. That's nothing. I can't take care of everything. Are you the one who runs this place? I am Bromo, this is my house, and these are my girls. I like my girls. And if you like my girls too, then you'll pay for it, 50 gold pieces. And don't get the idea of making trouble here. Are all your girls accounted for? Of course they are. Or do you think I want to go to jail over something like that? Uh, I wasn't asking about your payroll. I mean, are they all present? Or have any gone missing? Oh yeah. Actually, one of my girls has up and left. Her name's Lucia. I reported it to the militia too, but they claim they haven't found a trace of her yet. How long has Lucia been missing? Several days. I don't know exactly how long. I assume she ran off with one of her suitors, eh? That bitch made off with part of my savings, a really valuable golden dish, eh? If I get out of her, I give her what for. So how is that any business of yours, eh? Do you want to have fun or not? I used to say that myself. He better shut up. Hey, I can't take care of you now, baby. Talk to Bromar if you want to have some fun. I just want to ask you a few questions about those missing people. I could tell you a thing or two, but not here, honey. Then let's go upstairs. That's Fine, secret. but you get it settled with Bromar first. I don't want any trouble. Who says things like that? I want to have some fun. Fine. You're not likely to forget the next few hours of your life anytime soon. Go upstairs with Nadja then. Have fun. And he works all day too. Let's go upstairs. Today's your lucky day, baby. Let's go. That's terrible. Talk to Bromar if you want to have some fun. No idea. You tell me. I've got no time for things like that. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. Nobody hey, you! I'm busy. Hey, what's up? Man, I'm busy. Leave me alone. So can we talk now? We've got enough privacy up here. Bromar doesn't like to see us talk to guests during work if there's nothing in it for him. So you want to know more about the people who disappeared down here at the harbor, do you? I don't know whether I can help you much, but at least I can tell you what became of Lucia. That's not what I heard. Tell me about Lucia. Nobody here is too sorry that she's gone. Why? I don't think there was anyone here whom she didn't try to use. She was a real bitch. Where did she disappear to? She used to see a lot of Elverich, the apprentice of Thorben. 
the carpenter from the lower part of town. I bet she's up and left with that young man. He can't keep anything to himself. Where could the two of them have gone? If the wolves didn't need them, I suppose they went to stay with the farmers. Where else would they go? What else do you know? I've heard many stories about people who disappeared down here at the harbor, but I'm not so sure whether I should believe them. You should have a chat with the merchants down here. That's all I can tell you, alas. Now, what about the two of us, sweetie? You paid for it, after all. Wouldn't you like to have a little fun before you leave? Thanks, but I've got to go now. Too bad. Well, maybe next time. Really have known better. I won't tell her a thing from now on. Tell me that is not true. Don't That's say you not didn't what I heard. heard. As if I didn't have enough problems. Tell me that isn't true. I don't believe this is going to change. That's not what I heard. Ever asked hey, do you need fish? Get your fish here, fresh from the depths of the sea. Those are all just rumors. That will never change. Show me your fish. It's really not my problem. Can you tell me something about those missing people? Missing people? This is a harbor, pal. Things like that are bound to happen. The sea is treacherous and bound to claim a life now and then. Captains of large vessels will always sign on new sailors in a large seaport such as Corinis to complete their crews. And if they don't find any volunteers, some people may get dragged off against their will, and then they're gone. Who said that? I couldn't care. Are you missing someone? Me? No. Who said that? Do you know of anyone who's gone missing? No idea. Ask the shipbuilders. What ship would that have been? Good question. Not many ships have come into Corinus lately. That is true. You should really have known better. That's the first I've heard of it. That's all just gossip. Why haven't I heard about this before? That was no big deal. I knew that would be a problem. You have never thought of that yourself. What are you cooking there? Oh, fish soup. It's not all that tasty, but at least it's hot. You can try a plateful, if you like. What can you tell me about the city? Most citizens in this town are afraid of thieves. Therefore, it's not a good idea to enter strange houses. But if you're looking for a place to stay overnight, you're welcome to sleep in my hut. There is an extra bed that you can have. Aren't you afraid of thieves? The only valuable thing that I ever owned has already been taken. Oh, someone stole my statue of Inos. That's what I've said. Could you cook me some soup? I cook for everybody. For you too, if you want. All you need to do is bring me a fish. Could you cook me some soup? Nothing could be simpler. Here, have a plate. Could you cook me some soup? No, not today. Come back tomorrow.
as if I didn't I don't know why he gets so worked up. Believe me. That's no secret. Nothing amazes me anymore. For that is the will of the Nos. And there's more, believe me. But he knew that all along. Hey, you. You have no business up here. Only paladins and those of us in the militia have access here. What's up here, then? This is the provisions store of the Royal Guard of the Paladins. I am the provisions master here, and I'm responsible for seeing to it that none of the Paladin stuff goes astray, and you're not wanted here. So keep your hands to yourself, or I'll chop them off. Don't say you didn't know that. Can you sell me any of the Paladin stuff? You want to buy? Hmm. Let's say that if you could compensate me for the trouble that will arise from the Paladin's things wandering off, then we might be able to do business. Does that happen often? Things going astray? As long as the Provisions Master says that everything is right, no. I see. You're looking for the man who is selling weapons to the bandits? Says who? Says Vatras. Oh. What do you know about it? Not much, but I could find out more. Ah, is that so? Tell me, what do you know about the weapons dealer? Listen, we know that an influential citizen in the upper quarter must be behind it. And some of the weapons are even supposed to have come from the militia's supplies. We still don't know exactly who's behind it. If you have enough goods to take on a group of at least five bandits, maybe you can find out. What about the bandits? We know that the bandits are currently blockading the roads that connect the farmers to the city. Besides that, I know that there must have been a weapons delivery in the last few days. Maybe some clues to uncover the weapons dealer could be found with the bandits. Don't say you didn't know that. All the crates still there? Don't touch anything or I'll call the watch. Got it? What do you have to offer? Then pay attention. Hey, you! You're a fisherman? Now how did you ever guess that? Can't you simply leave me alone? Don't take it personally, but I haven't been too happy lately. It's that militia. Trouble with the militia? Those bastards keep coming here and taking whatever they want. Last week, they made off with my entire catch. It's for a good cause, they said. 
I know that everybody's got to fend for himself since the farmers have stopped trading. And, of course, sometimes people just go hungry. Small wonder that they're snatching the fish from right under my nose. But if they keep doing this, I won't even have enough to feed myself. Have you talked to the paladins about this? <laughs> Are you joking? Do you really think they'd be interested if a poor devil like me has his problems with the militia? Maybe I can help you. I don't know. I suppose you'd have to know somebody from the militia who has connections to the paladins. The paladins will hardly buy the fish from me. I shall see what I can do. So, how are the fish biting? I've seen better times. Too little to live on, too much to die. Can you tell me something about the missing people? My friend William started hanging out with a bunch of shady characters. And where did it get him? One day, he simply didn't show up for work. And that's the last we saw of him. Your buddy William has disappeared? So he has. He's a fisherman, but a little too big for his boots, I should add. He should have stayed well away from that bunch. What's he been up to? William had some shady dealings with those crooks. I think it was all about contraband that he sold to the bastards. What bastards would those be? I don't know who they are or what their business is here in Corinus. I only know the place where they met up with William. I just happened to see William there when I was fishing in the bay. Where exactly is that meeting place? There's a bay opposite the harbor, north of here. You can only reach it by boat or swim. There's a beach there and a small fishing camp. That's where I saw them. When did you last see him? Only a few days ago. Maybe he just went out to sea to fish. That's not very likely. His boat is still moored in the harbor. He'll surface again. I don't think so. He's been gone for too long already. I'm afraid that I'll be dragging his body from the sea at some point. I think I've heard enough. Spare yourself the effort. I don't believe you'll find him.
Wait a minute. Where do you think you're going? I wanted to... There's nothing here to see. Now move along. I want to get aboard the ship. No one may enter the ship. I have my orders. I shall kill anyone who enters the ship without authorization. In the name of Inos, I shall defend the ship with my life.
Hey, you! Tharam the fisherman has problems with the militia. The boys are constantly stealing from him. And what do I have to do with it? You have a certain amount of influence up here with the paladins. Tharam needs your protection. He's willing to give you a part of his catch for it. I see what you mean. Fish. As if I didn't have enough crap to deal with. Tell your pal he should come to me and tell me exactly what's up with the militia. I'll take care of it. Hey, you! Uh, about the weapons dealer? What was that again? Listen, you're supposed to find out who's behind the weapons deliveries to the bandits and bring me proof. But it has to be really incriminating evidence, otherwise I can't arrest the guy. Hey! I know how to resolve your trouble with the militia. And how would that be? Martin, the provisions master of the Paladins, wants to hear your story about the militia and the fish. And you think he can make the militia leave me alone? At least that's what he said. Great! Thank you! I cannot give you much, but wait! I found this strange blue stone on one of the islands off the coast of Corinus. I don't think it's worth a whole lot, but someone like you will certainly find a use for it. It's really not my problem. As if I didn't have enough problems. Would it ever change? That's exactly what I said. I'm not telling you anything new. Is it true that some townspeople have simply vanished? So I've heard, but I'm not sure whether it's really true. Just look around you. Does this rat hole look like the place where you want to spend your golden years? <laughs> Small wonder that people are getting themselves out of here. What are you doing here? My name is Brahim. I draw maps and sell them. 
Since you're new here, maybe you could use a map of the city? It's quite affordable and very useful until you know your way around. Show me your maps. Just rumors. That was obvious all along. I agree with you completely. Why have come back again later? I, I'm sure to have something new for you then. Why haven't I heard about this before? Nothing surprises me anymore. Let's wait and see what happens. You listen to the wrong people. Will it ever change? Hey! What are you doing here? I'm building a ship because I want to get out of here as fast as I can. But the way it looks right now, this ship will never be finished. Why are you in such a hurry? Soon the orcs will come and burn down the city. What makes you think that? Boy, have you noticed the paladins running around everywhere? Why do you think they're here? I tell you, they're here because the orcs will attack soon, and that won't be pretty. Why can't you finish your ship? Oh, we have thousands of problems. The hull still isn't stable, and it's still missing a lot of boards. But I have hardly any gold left to buy new material with, and the last delivery had bugs in it. My boys don't work productively. One wants a fast ship above all else, the other one is worried about the figurehead. As if we didn't have more important things to do. Also, one of my people is simply not showing up for work anymore. I'm beginning to fear that this will delay the construction even more. You're one worker short? Yes. His name is Monty. He's vanished into thin air. That lazy pig is probably living the high life on a farm somewhere. I should never have paid him in advance. I've heard that other people have gone missing too. Just what I'm saying. That's where the evil starts. Farum, the fisherman, told me something similar. His buddy William is no longer around. I bet that the orcs are behind all this. Can I help you somehow? Yes, you can. Find out what the paladins are planning. I want to know why they're here. And I have to know if the orcs will attack and how far from the city they are. One of the bastards was even seen outside the city. Just bring me all the information you can get. I need to know how much time I have left to finish the boat. What's going on at the harbor? The orcs are breathing down our necks and you're asking about the harbor? I only wanted to... The biggest problem we have is that there aren't enough ships in the harbor to get us out of here. To be honest, there's only one ship here, and that belongs to the Paladins. They certainly won't let us get out of here with that. As to that orc outside of town? Yes. Don't worry about him. The city guard is going to take care of him. Good. If you find out more, let me know. I've got some information about the orcs. Let's hear it. They're stuck in the Valley of Mines, and it looks like they're going to stay there. To be on the safe side, the Paladins are guarding the pass. Good. If you find out more, let me know. Hey! Oh, you landlubber. Looks like you're stranded here. You look a bit pale around the gills. Never mind, my lad. All you need is a good stiff sea breeze. What are you doing here? Back when I was a young man, I went to sea and rode through many a big storm. No big deal, not at all. But that old tower came closest to what I call a home. I haven't been up there in ages. Why not? Ever since these scallywags took over my lighthouse, I haven't dared get closer to it than 20 feet. Really bad rabble, that. They're criminals from the Valley of Mines, you know. There was this big bang on the other side of the mountains, and they swarmed all over the land like flies. Now they're hiding out everywhere, even in my lighthouse. 
I think they're on the lookout for any ship they can raid. Ah, let them. Then at least they'd be out of my tower. Do you come to town often? I always say, a town is only as good as its harbor. A harbor is the gate to the world. That's where everyone meets, and where everything starts. Once the harbor goes to the dogs, the rest of the city will follow soon. Tell me about the harbor. The harbor of Corinus isn't what it used to be. There's nothing but riffraff hanging about. The ships don't come anymore, and trade is dead. This harbor is about to go under. Why are the ships no longer coming? They all say that once the war is over, everything will be like it used to be. That's a load of bilge water. I tell you, a sailor can see when a town's going downhill. A sailor feels that in his blood. And I can tell you, forget about this harbor. This heyday's over. So why don't you leave? Nobody would take an old sea dog like me on his ship these days. Most people think that old Jack's got the gout in his rotten old bones. And? Are they right? Balderdash. Once I've got those planks beneath me feet again, I'll feel like a young whippersnapper. What do you mean by riffraff? Look at them, the lazy rabble. Most of them don't even know what work is. All they do is drink all day and spend their last pay at the brothel. I tell you, stay away from them. I've got your sword. Ah, that's much better than fighting with an old stick. <laughs> 